Hi, welcome to Kindred Spirit Readings. Let's begin Aquarius. I am getting a lot of mixed messages about you. I'm also getting one of those mixed messages for me, uh, for you, is to do with relationships. People that you used to know that you were once close with and there are different levels of closeness and how you feel and react and get along with other people and how those relationships have, have formed over the last few years, maybe even decades. But these kind of messages coming through for me, I'm going to start with say singles so if you are single or if you were single uh, it really doesn't matter for you guys if, if there's a lot of you learning about what your limits are you're learning a lot about yourself throughout the process and you're learning a lot about who you do not want to end up being or who you don't want to end up with in general or you know this is all about what's grinding your gears you know if somebody's not suited to you, you're making it very clear and you're not taking a back seat anymore to others playing with your emotions you know, this has been a long time coming for you and you've tried to manage. This is this is uh, the, as, as best as you can. I think now you're actually beginning to show not only to yourself but uh, to others that the strongest part of you is the will to make things become or end up the way that you want them to be. Finally, you know, uh, it's almost as though it is a breakthrough for you and it's amazing it, to see that, um, especially when you experience something like this, you finally stand up for what you want. The energy is incredible. I mean, you're really just so sure about whatever it is that you're faced with, with no matter what you're going through, no matter how hard times have been for you, you're, you're done with all the BS. You're done with all the extra baggage, so to speak. And for you, um, while you're dealing with a lot of people bringing, bringing that into your life, the, the BS and the extra baggage and the other stuff that you just simply don't need emotionally, physically, whatever it was, it was unnecessary. It played with your emotions. It played with your time. It played with you, uh, you know, um, in general. So you put a lot of effort into becoming who you are. Uh, you made it, you made that very clear from day one, that this was rather important to you, uh, to take care of you. And it just got messed around with you. You were torn between deciding, making a decision, pardon me, making a decision between two people or three people or depending on your situation. I'm talking about families, relationships. This is all just finally uh, now coming to an end, which is really good to see because this comes along with clarity and there is there is confirmation there for you as an individual, as a human being to turn your life around, finally getting it, having it your way. And there are no other two ways about it. I mean, however, however that translates to you, this is an astonishing result and such a great outcome in terms of being comfortable enough to say no to something that just simply doesn't work for you. And if you are coupled, this is really tricky, but it is almost time for you to get, um, to let go. And I'm, I'm not saying specifically of the person you're with, but I'm talking about the balance between your emotions and your decisions based on where you see yourself in the relationship. So for a long time, there was that struggle to express to your significant other who you were, who you were, um, uh, you know, what you were all about, what you wanted to be, where you saw yourself. Even though you're in a partnership, it doesn't mean there isn't any you left. This is truly amazing and they will support you, whoever you are whoever you share your life with, or if you're looking to turn things into something more with whoever you are with, whatever the case may be, as long as there's somebody in your life sharing it with you, they will understand you, where you're coming from. Is it, It's necessary to have a little give and take and to be understanding both ways from both ends. But at the end of the day, you have not forgotten about yourself. Thank you, Aquarius.